nice little Sunday treat. We're gonna do duck, duck breast fillet with a red wine and bone marrow, beef bone marrow, jus or broth or gravy, whatever the bleeding hell you want to call it. But that's what's happening. Oh yeah, and a slightly sexy, creamy, buttery mashed potato with extra fine, finest green beans from the Andalusian mountains of fucking second left ball bag. Don't fucking say anything about ball bags, right. Anyway, but my green beans are special because they're gonna be crunchy with a lemon zest and some lemon juice on them. So you've got that nice little citrusy acidity next to the rich and pungent flavors of the game meat of the duck and the jus gravy that I've created. So let's get started with, first of all, I've been reducing this shit for some time now. Uh, this shit, see, I had to turn it off so it's gone like a jelly because the corn, because the corn flour in it. So I'm just heating that back up now. And then we've got this fucker, look at this. Look at that flaming sausage, scored the meat, yeah. That's gonna pan fry nicely. That's the lemon, that's the thing. It's all gonna go according to plan. We should hope, but I've done this before. So obviously it's gonna be good because, come on, let's face it. I am marvelous, you'll know this. Anyhow, let's get started, you bunch of bell ends. What's happening, knob cheeses? Look, first we're gonna pan fry the duck, yeah? Skin side down, hot pan. See, I've got lard in there. Got lard. A bit of um, butter as well, you know. I won't go into the details of that. If you know, you know. Ooh. Sizzling state of affairs. We're just gonna slightly brown off the skin. Yeah. Skin's gonna get brown. And then we're just gonna seal the rest of it. And then that's gonna go in the oven for between 12 and 15 minutes. Depending on how you want your duck. If you want it quite rare and, and red in the middle, uh, you want to be doing it for about 12. If you want it a bit more well done, 15. Overdone, 16, 17 minutes if you're among. That's down to you. If you've got no fucking taste. Anyway, look, it's working. It's working. See this? Ooh. Look at that bastard. Back on. Ooh. And then, and then, this is going to be taking shape. This is, can't see it in there, can you? There's no bleeding light. I'll bring back to that in a bit now. We'll turn that down. Smoke it. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. Get the brown sides off. some more water which I like to use obviously liquefy them up yes 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 and we've got yeah back to me creamy mash going in hard I've had that in the oven warming up because I prepared it early well and did all the mixing and all that shit but I'm going to do some other shit to it in a bit. Like, uh, move it around, get it a bit more moist. You don't like that word, right? Moist. And here we got green beans. Ready to go in that beautiful steam oil. There you go. So back over here we go. Take the notes of that shit. This is the corn flour. A little bit of advice. Whenever you do corn flour or sauce flour, you want to mix it with some water. All right. 
don't just want to bang it in because you'll get clumps and it'll take you forever to get it out. Just use to thicken up the sauce or the gravy or whatever you've done. But I call it jus. Anyway, enough about that shit. We do the green beans right at the end because they only take two minutes and I'll have the zest of that and the juice of that ready to go all over it and it's going to be absolutely fantastic. I'm just going to get this all jus warmed up here. Look, here this shit, it will get a lot silkier than that and like glazy, glistening, see-through glistening. It's beautiful. It's a beautiful thing. So is duck. I'm going to do it. for about 12 to 13 minutes, because I like it medium rare, juicy. Uh, you get more of the flavor that way. You don't want to overcook duck or lamb really. But then again, I did have lamb once at my dad's and he likes to overcook the lamb and it's still very delicious. But with duck, you don't really want to do that shit because it gets tight and shite, much like steak. You can't spend money on a decent cut of meat and overcook the bastard. You know, if you've got an educated palate, of course, like me. Anyway, I'll come back to you in a sec. I'm just going to do all my shit and uh, fuck off. Right, there was a key factor that I just forgot to mention here. A massive one. When I pan fried the duck in the pan, yeah, see this glistening bastard here? That jizz there. That is lard, which FYI is actually pork fat. Who knew? Bit of butter, yeah, bit of olive oil to, uh, you know, Harness the glow, and I'm gonna do this there. Look, see that? Kissing the on. Look at that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and then the solution presents itself. You've got the fat in there. Then I've got bone marrow uh, stuck in there from bones, from cows, ribs. So all you vegans and veggies out there, I'm not sorry, that's your problem, right? Anyway, yeah, so that's gonna be flaming fantastic. And uh, we'll see how we go, shall we? Mm. Now, green beans, we've had three and a half minutes-ish in the steamer, here we go, there. Sprinkled a bit of Himalayan pink sea salt on them. Move that shit around a bit, yeah. Oh, that's a bit of salt on there. You see this? This lemon zest. I've got a zest of a lemon. I'm going to bang that on. Fab. Fucking wonderful, that is, isn't it? This. You need a bit of the lemon, just enough for the juice. I'm going to move him around. Don't mind about a pip. Fuck off. Move that shit around. Glistening, yes. In the meantime, we've got our jus. We've got our fucking duck. Now mashed potato. Let's see what happens, shall we? Okay, here we are. Here is the duck. Beautiful. Crispy skin. Lovely mash. Look at that. Oh, lemon zest on those beans. Fantastic. And we have a beautiful jus in the token zizz, whatever you want to call it. And we're just going to... Woohoo! Eehee! However much you want to put on, I've just gone to town then with that shit, but... Ooh, ooh, what should we do, eh? Look at that shit. And that's how it happens. We've got duck. Pan-fried duck. We've got creamy mash. A bit of lemon juice. A slight bit of rosemary in there as well. Green beans, acidity. And a red wine and bone marrow jus. Enjoy. Have a nice Sunday evening. God bless.